Good morning. So today is the 10th of March and it's Mother's Day. So happy Mother's Day to my mum, Queen Jean, and to my mother-in-law, Millie, because I know you'll be watching this. Uh, we've just left our little short stay at Broom Hill and we're just coming through to Amble on his way down to Newbegin by the sea. So we're just going through Amble. Quite nice, actually. Yeah, yeah. Ambalabum Village. It's uh, not a very nice day today. It rained all night, and it rained all morning. But it looks like the rain has subsided a little bit. Still a bit cold, but not too cold. Sorry about that, it's suddenly cutting off, but we had a bit of a technical issue problem. We, uh, as SD card run out, and we had to run all over looking for an Argos to get an SD card. So we are now on our way to New Begin. While we've been looking for an SD card, I've been doing a bit of Google searching and trying to find out where my nana's grave is, because she's buried up at this church, St Bartholomew's in New Begin. She died way before I was born, uh, before I was even thought of. So we're going to find it. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I've found it on the internet. Uh, if you go on Find My Grave, you just need to put a couple of details in and it will find your family members and you can see where they've been buried. So we'll pick you back up once we get into New Begin Church Point. So we've just come in halfway down the street of Newbegin there's some places I just can't remember it's changed a hell of a lot I do remember oh, the Central Club that's where uh, all my family used to do leak shows and I do remember Queen's head, not that I ever went in. And I think there's a pub up here, and it's the last pub, if I do believe rightly, before you get to Norway. The last pub before you get to Norway. Yeah. And it's the Cresswell Arms. down into that one there's a sign or there was a sign oh my god that seal looks rough if only this Park Dean Resort took and there she it tore us and there is St Bartholomew's Church it's not a very big church but this is where my mum and dad got married this is where I became a bridesmaid for the very first time and somewhere in there is all my relatives so we will have a look round Welcome to St Bartholomew's Church New Begin by the Sea so this church was built in the 13th century by the 18th century, it became a ruin, but by 1845, it was rebuilt. 
and this is where my mum got married. And we're on a mission, or I'm on a mission, to find my family's grave. And I don't believe, oh, this is one of them. So I'll have a look at this one first. William Buddles, beloved husband of Hannah Buddles of Newbegin, died 6th of May 1905 at 63. My mum said, through the gates, turn left then right. And just as you come through the gate, you can see that one. And I'll fetch some some daffs to put on it because it is Mother's Day and it is my nana. Surely to God we can find it. This is it's on end. Oh it's down there. Well guys, I found it. Just took the wrong path. So here we are. This is my nana's grave. This is my mum's mum and dad. A little Christmas tree on. And the one next is my mum's brother, my Uncle Alan. Happy Mother's Day, Nana. Welcome back guys to a windy and blustery New Begin by the Sea. So having a little walk round, it is quite quite blustery out there. The waves are looking quite big. I don't know whether you can hear me. I'm having to shout. That's the I don't think you can see it very good, but that's the two statues. I'm not quite sure who they are and who did them but the last time I came to New Begin they wasn't there <gasps> the size of these waves and I do believe this is the time capsule on the 9th of September 2000 beneath this stone lies a time capsule containing mementos of the 20th century life in poems, pictures and in writing created by children from New Begin by the Sea. The capsule is to be opened in 100 years time. Well, <laughs> definitely not. So this is the time capsule. So we definitely will not be here when this is opened. Oh, mummy neck. I bet on a lovely summer's day this is beautiful. Oh, wow. here and I can remember 
walking all the way along here down there and the youth swimming around there they used to be an outdoor swimming paddling pool that I used to go in and none of this was here oh lovely neck it's gold again now uh, we've just come off and these steps off top loads more not as cold down here I bet they're freezing out there than people uh, I do believe this is a maritime museum now this wasn't here when uh, I was little so we've got a blue plaque so this one is New begin by the sea. The ancient port, once a major port, third only importance to London and Hull for the shipping of corn. It's part of Heritage Trail. I don't think you have to pay to go in there, have you? No. Breakwater Cafe, seashore shops, an exhibition area. That's a nice sign. Stop, sit and enjoy the view every once in a while. And what a view that is. So, has it changed much love since we were last year? Well, you have. <laughs> I know you have. <laughs> can't in remember. What way? It. Can't remember if I'm honest. I can't. Some things look new, some things are new. Uh, I mean, like that, that one there. The guys in the sea over there, they wanted there. Uh, it, yeah, some cash fishing, must be mad. Fishing for the supper. Bud, come on. Buddy, are you going in sand, lad? You just like the beach. I don't believe when the tide is out, you can get to that couple. Buddy. But I think the tide's got to go some way, way out. Definitely it's got to go way out. You couldn't have if you were pretty steep. I've got to swim it, can I? Yeah. Like I say, it goes, this prom goes all the way around and I do believe there's a, there was a school somewhere up there and that's the school that I think my mum went to because this is a place where my mum's from my mum was born around here now it's nice to come back to see where your parents originated from What if Here. Oh, to one beach. Come on. Nice bit of driftwood. New Begin Rocket House. I don't believe this is the, the lifeboat station. I remember this. This is all a bit new. But this established in 1851 I remember this I remember the old fishing boats oh so that's that's a replica of what's out there oh so we'll go find out what this is Yeah, but it might tell you more. So this is... I'm not going up these steps. They're a bit high for me, these. Ow. So I do believe... Oh, there's a picture up here. This is... 
But these two are looking out out there. And there is some information up here, so we'll just have a quick walk up and have a look at this board and see what it's got to say, might give us some information. Herring House. So this must be where These must have been the houses for the fishermen, I do believe. Looks like not about all did it. But this guys and the two guys out there looking out to see. Do what they're thinking. Let's carry on. Ah, but he's having a... I hope this water don't come over Because if it does, somebody's going to get wet Oh, look at that for a property Looking out to sea If this died comes in over the wall <laughs> one of us is gonna get wet rescue point whoa Remember this, this has been some years, I remember coming down here for an ice cream, so this is like the town centre bit, this is the, the, the bit where it comes downhill and from both sides and this is like the centre. Now remember the cobble? Definitely remember this. Would it come off? It's the same name as it was years ago. This is new to me though. Oh, and if you come into New Begin, there's an Easter fair on Sunday the 31st of March, 11 mile 4. All around this area. Another Another pub. Nice little bandstand. And I do believe somewhere around here, I'm not quite, I could be wrong. I'm not 100% sure, but my mum's got a photo and I think my granddad stood outside this shop. Ship shape. It used to be his undertaker's shop, I do believe. So we'll head on up what they call the High Street. Not many people about today due to it being Sunday and it's Mother's Day and it's wet and it's cold and it's windy. Quite a few shops. This looks like a charity shop. Oriental chef, Chinese. I can remember some of these shops and some are, are quite new.
seem strange walking up here. It don't seem like it used to. I suppose things change. Smells nice. Central. A lot of my family used to go drinking when we were kids. That's where they used to do old leak shows. We're at back of here, wasn't it? No. Me and my cousin lived. No, I can't. No, I can't. I knew you'd come up past here. And you went down one of these side streets. Another pub, Queen's Head. It's just a shame that there's no overnight parking in this car park that we parked up in and the campsite is just a static campsite so there's no overnight parking there either uh, no touring which is a shame because they'll be losing out and a lot of a lot of money generated from people wanting to stay over up to the last pub the Cresswell Arms before you get to Norway and it did have a sign on the side of this building I'll see if it's still there Music, karaoke, like a sports bar. I have not. I haven't, I'll prove it to you. Do you know how I know? Let me cross the road. Do you know how I know this? Because I did Google this pub and on Google. Oh no, it's here, look. See? There you go. The last pub for Norway, Cresswell Arms, and we're now back to St Bartholomew's 
Church car park, Church Point, Newbegin by the sea and that's where Reckless is parked.